Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel. As you can tell by the title of this video, I am going to be reorganizing my bookshelves yet again. If you watched my video from a few weeks ago, I transformed my bookshelves into rainbow shelves, which is my current setup. And as I mentioned in that video, I wasn't really sure if I was going to like them. I was a little concerned about the functionality of having rainbow shelves. And now that I've had them for about, I think like a month or maybe just over a month, I can say that as pretty as they are, they weren't super functional for me in my life. So I'm going to be switching it up today. Like I said, I did actually enjoy having the rainbow shelves. I found that they're really pretty. They're really nice for Instagram photos. I do wish I had a bit more like colored books to make it more vibrant, but because I read primarily fantasy, there aren't a ton of super vibrant books in that genre. Although they are doing better lately with new releases. I'm gonna go back to a different system. So I'm going to try something new, which is similar to what I've done in the past, but a little bit more organized. So I'm going to be switching from the rainbow shelves I currently have to a genre-based system, but within genre, I'm gonna try and alphabetize by author's last name, which I've never done before. I do apologize that this, this video is like so close to my last reorganization video. Uh, I just thought while I'm doing it, I might as well show you guys because I know some of you wanted an update on how I felt about the rainbow shelves. My update is that I did enjoy them, but it wasn't super functional for me. They really brightened up my room, especially during the winter when everything is like so dreary. It was nice to have something so bright and happy. I kept waiting for myself to get used to where books were. And I'm sure like if I had the rainbow shelves for a long time, then I would like adapt to where every book is and I wouldn't struggle so much to find things. But after it being like at least a month of the rainbow shelves and still not being sure where books are, it's just too long of an adjustment period for me. So I'm going to take all the books off, I'm going to clean my shelves, and then I'm going to start organizing the books into genre and then from that alphabetizing by last name. I'm really excited to give it a try. So I hope you enjoy watching me reorganize my bookshelves yet again and hopefully this system will work a little bit better than the rainbow shelves. So if you want to see how I transform this into a new system, just keep watching.
Okay, so I have taken all the books off, I cleaned my shelf, and I have attempted to do a bit of organizing with the alphabetical last name. I think I'm going to start with fantasy because that's the most books that I have. So I think I'm going to start with fantasy here and then we'll see how far I get. Um, but yeah, here we go. Here is the new system. As I said, it is genre-based by alphabetical by the author's last name. And so we have um, this section is all fantasy, all the way over until this little one, until the very bottom where it switches. I have a couple graphic novels down there. And then at the top, I decided to keep a Harry Potter shelf separate. I didn't do alphabetical just because I have so many. So that top shelf is just Harry Potter. And then we get into YA Contemporary. I have two and a half shelves of YA Contemporary. So there, and then we move right into classics here. Then we have adult contemporary romance and adult contemporary. They are separated, but they are alphabetical within that. And then we have 
historical fiction along the bottom into mystery slash thriller, and the very last section is nonfiction at the bottom. Okay, so we are all finished. I have a whole new system now, and I actually really, really like it. As I was doing it, I was just like, oh, this makes my heart so happy. I just love organization, and having it alphabetical by genre, I really like it. So I think the system is probably going to stay for a really long time, and I'm really happy with the way it turned out. Everything kind of fits together so nicely, and so far I'm really happy with it, and I hope you enjoyed watching my process and watching me reorganize. Let me know in the comments below how you organize your bookshelves because I'd love to know if you have a similar system to mine or something completely different. Um, and if you're not already, I would love if you would subscribe to my channel. Make sure you hit that notification bell so you don't miss when I upload. And be sure to give this video a thumbs up if you enjoyed it. So thank you so much for watching. I will see you in my next video.